Hello and welcome back to ChatGPT Prompt Engineering Tutorial Series. In the previous video, we had developed a basic good structure for a ChatGPT prompt, which consists of a combination of at least a primary component which is either instructions or questions, plus one or more of the three components, context, parameters, or format. Today, we will take the structure a few steps ahead and add more components to get even more professional or precise outcome. First, we can assign a role or a profession to the module, so it can generate the output more efficiently. Let's take the following basic structure which consists of a request and character limit. Could you please write for me a product review about iPhone 15 Pro? It should be about 200 words. Now, we want the module to generate the outcome as he is a marketing expert. Therefore, we can write. Imagine you are a marketing expert. Could you please write for me a product review about iPhone 15 Pro? It should be about 200 words. Now the system will act as a marketing expert and try to generate the results as close as an expert. Compare the output with the previous prompt's output to see the difference in style and structure. Now let's try to change the role of the module to a tech expert. Imagine you are a tech expert. Could you please write for me a product review about iPhone 15 Pro? It should be about 200 words. The output will be generated as if a tech expert is writing it. In addition to the role, we can add even more advanced components to the structure. We can attach some examples to the prompt for ChatGPT to examine and produce the output similar to those examples. Let's assume that we want to write a customer style review about the following product. And add a couple of examples from the page to the end of the prompt as follows. Could you please write for me a review about Incline Women's Bracelet Watch? It should be about 100 words. It should be similar to a customer review style. Please check those examples to come up with similar style and format. Then we will copy and paste some customer reviews from the product's main page. Please note that you should press Shift plus Enter, instead Enter, if you want a new line inside the same prompt. The injected examples will affect the style and the format of the output. Let's move to a new technique, questioning, which is exactly the opposite of questions, which is requesting ChatGPT to ask you questions for additional criteria before producing the final output. We can add the following to the previous example. Could you please write for me a review about Incline Women's Bracelet Watch? It should be about 100 words. It should be similar to a customer review style. Please ask me about the key elements to include in the review. As you see, ChatGPT will enter in a dialogue with you, asking about the required elements.
After you provide him with the answer, it will generate the final output. Now, let's try another advanced technique, indicating a goal or aim. For example, your goal from the previous review could be to sell the product. Therefore, you can rephrase your prompt as follows. Could you please write for me a review about and Klein Women's Bracelet Watch? It should be about 100 words. It should be similar to a customer review style. At the end of the review, entice the customer to buy the product. The output now will have some content to encourage the customer to buy the product. Finally, let's have a comprehensive example. Imagine you are a science expert. This is the role, and you have to explain the Big Bang Theory to a person with no scientific background. This is the context. Explain the Big Bang Theory to him. This is the instructions, in about 100 words. This is the parameters. Make it in a friendly style. This is the format. At the end of the explanation, please encourage him to buy the following book related to the topic, before the Big Bang. And this is the final goal. More similar videos on the way soon, therefore please like and subscribe to not miss any upcoming videos. Bye for now.